How's it going viewers? Thank you guys for watching my video. In this video I will be doing a review on the Spingen Neo Hybrid case. Um, as you guys can see this is it for the iPhone 6. Um, there it is. I'm just going to start by talking about what it's made out of. There, It is a two piece uh, case. There's a plastic let's say shell or exterior and then the inside is just a soft rubber. You can see it moves and you can take it out and take it off. So I'm going to go ahead and keep it on. Um, so there, it's got a little bit of a texture here on the on the back. The tops are smooth where the forehead and the chin are. Um, the back's got a little bit of a textured a little bit of a textured area. Um, it doesn't really grip as much as I thought it would by looking at the texture, but it's still there's a little bit of I guess you could say a little bit of grip, something. It's a different kind of texture. It's not as smooth. And then, so going on to the inside here, they got their little uh, anti-scratch, anti-moving, I guess you can call, uh, design there. Um, they got their little seal, the authentic, the original uh, Spingen seal, saying that it's the original part. Uh, on the outside, the buttons do stick out, so that is kind of nice if you're holding it. You can kind of get a better feel at them. They got openings for everything on the bottom. So now I'm just going to go ahead and install the phone. The way you want to do it, the way I usually do it is the part that's got the most amount of buttons, the two buttons and the vibrate switch there. I stick that in first, make sure that's in and then just roll it over and I just push on the two corners till it pops into place. So that is in place as you guys can see. So that is what it looks like when it's installed on the phone. So now I'm just going to go ahead and talk about the openings starting here on this side. There is an open the opening for the vibrate switch. Only kind of downside to that is it's kind of hard to get to. You gotta really got to get in there. If, if you're someone that constantly switches, uh, this might be a hassle. That's the one of the harder things that I've noticed about that. The volume buttons, like I said before, stick out so they're nice to find when when you're not exactly looking for... When you're looking for the buttons, um, the next we got here are the headphone jack, uh, the charging cable, and then the speaker and opening for the speakers. So that is nice. So now I'm just gonna go ahead and check out the holes. This is the my headphones for the original Apple headphones. As you can see, that fits in there nice and easy. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and move to an after. I guess a third party. It's not. They're not exact. They're headphones, but they're not from Apple and those seem to be fitting fairly fairly well looks like I'm just trying to see if it's not being held up by by the edge of the case it doesn't seem like it might not have fit all the way in there um, as you guys can see there I'm not quite sure so I'm going to go ahead and move on to the charger the, re the regular Apple charger that fits in there nice and easy as you guys can see I'll move on to uh, another I guess third party I guess you can call them not an Apple charger that also fits so fits nice and easy in there with no problems um, so those are the three openings on the bottom headphones charger and then the little speaker so moving on they got a little Neo hybrid the name of their case on here and then the power button on the side for the iPhone 6 um, so there's that. Also sticks out like the volume buttons. Makes it nice to get, not nice to find when you're kind of looking for it. Even though when you're used to your phone, you know exactly where that button's at. And there's nothing on the top, just a plastic cover. Moving back to the back, all they got is the opening for the camera and the light. So that is that. And this case is fairly thin. I was actually surprised. I had a different case on my phone. Another case was a little bit thicker um, I guess a little bit harder to put away in your pocket uh, so I like this case it's a fairly nice case F seems fairly fairly rigid it'll take an impact not as much as those bigger cases but uh, I, I like this case overall so that is my review on this Spingen Neo Hybrid case for the iPhone 6 if you guys like this video if you want to see more like it go ahead and give me a thumbs up any comments questions concerns 
uh, put them in the comments section below. I will try to answer any kind of questions as soon as I can. Thanks for watching this video. Have a nice day.